Good morning, friends. It's Sammy back with another episode of The Daily Dash. That's right. It's everything you need to know from around the world and in my life, straight from my car dashboard to yours. Today is Thursday, July 16th, 2015. I know that confidently. Hi, Irvines, uh, because tomorrow is my birthday, 40th birthday. Um, and I was going to, the only thing I want, well, besides a blue pen and um, yeah, hey, besides my pens that I love is a strawberry cupcake from the cupcake collection here in Nashville. And I just was going to get one for myself. My husband said he's taking care of everything. So thanks, babe. Very excited about that. So let me bring you the news today before we uh, get into what else is going on here. Lots of presidential news. First of all, uh, George Bush, 41, H.W. Bush, broke his neck uh, and is said to be uh, in stable condition. So I guess not life-threatening, which is good news since he just turned 91 last month. Uh, President Obama uh, had a press conference yesterday and really was... Uh, candid, very kind of defensive, uh, talking about not only the Iran deal, but even addressing the um, Cosby allegations. So lots being said there. And then Trump, believe it or not, is leading the Republican presidential race. So who knows what's going on in this country right now. Uh, some lasers were flashed at planes in Newark, so no one was injured, but they had to reroute some landings there. Uh, Caitlyn Jenner accepted the Arthur Ashe uh, award for courage at the ESPYs last night. That's bringing about a lot of talk, as you can understand. And there was one more thing I was going to say, but I forgot. So you can look on my blog, sammycone.com for the rest of that. So we were out all day yesterday. We ended up touring both of the public schools that my kids would be zoned for if we moved and really ended up liking them both a lot. Thanks for the hearts guys. Uh, even the elementary school that my son was like, no, can I just like skip fourth grade and go to fifth grade so he could go to school with his sister? Um, really, really liked it. Renovated, um, very technologically advanced. So that was a pleasant surprise. We checked out the library in the area as well. So that was cool. And then I started my wellness Wednesday group last night. So this is, um, I told you yesterday, my new friend Leslie that I met through my Tuesday Together group. This is kind of crazy, all these things. Um, but yeah, here's my food journal. See, food journal. Uh, so this is actually pretty cool. That, and I know, I know all these things that we have to do. Uh, it's always been proven that if you actually write down what you're doing, even though there's apps like My Fitness Pal, writing things down. Sorry, there's a bug in my. Yeah, I can hear my husband saying squirrel. Yep, I know. Uh, if you write it down, your actual like food journal. Um, with pen and paper, it's proved to be more effective. So that's what we're going to do. I was not even going to tell you what uh, I weighed in at all that stuff last night. Let's just say my metabolic age is 80, like in the 80s, 81 or 84. Kind of sad. So anywho, hoping good things for this. We're going to lay low today since we were gone yesterday. We've got a lot of just cleaning and things to do. I've got some work to do um, for my various jobs. And this van is a disaster. I'm not even going to show you that. So just lots of little things to do, but I'm confident my uh, list will get crossed off today. I'm going to go paint my nails. I finally got the blue off. So hope you guys have a great day wherever you are. Make sure you make it great, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for the big four zero. Woo, woo. Okay, bye, friends.